happy morning students this is mohammad ashfaq and in this video we will be discussing missing numbers which is one of the topic in mpsc exam so missing numbers you will be given a set of numbers in which one number will be removed or eliminated and you will be asked to find that particular number with the help of the numbers which i have already given in the question so let's get into the topic let's solve the first sum find the missing numbers so here they have given around eight numbers you can see in three rows or in terms of three columns so we have to find a logic with these given numbers and with that help we have to replace this question mark so by seeing these numbers we can easily understand that here if we assume this as row 1 row 2 and row 3 and uh, if we see this number if we add this number with this number you will get this number so 44 Plus twelve is nothing but fifty-six. So the process over here is R two plus R three gives R one. Or in other words, we can do in a reverse way. R one minus R two is equal to R three. So if we see here, fifty-six minus twelve is equal to forty-four. So to find this question mark what we are supposed to do we are supposed to follow this pattern or this pattern whichever it is comfortable for you you can prefer that particular pattern so which is nothing but 14 plus question mark is equal to 65 which means question mark is equal to 65 minus 14 in the sense 5 minus 4 1 and 6 minus 1 5 and the question mark will be replaced by the number 51 and this number is in option D so the correct answer for this question is option D hope you have understood the concept and uh, these are the basic level questions that you can get in the exams there are questions which make you people to think which kill your time that we will enjoy in the next question i hope you got an idea how this missing numbers topic will work out we'll move to the next question find the missing number oh the matrix have been bit bigger when compared to the previous question how we are going to find the pattern over here so for the beginners it is very difficult to solve this question even if you assume this rows or in terms of columns This is row one, row two, row three, as well as row four, and this is column one, column two, column three, and column four, as well as column five, fifth column. So, how can you find the number that replaces this question mark? What can be the logic? how we are going to apply this logic so either we are going to add this numbers if we add 4 plus 9 9 plus 3 12 12 plus 2 14 but here we are getting zero so this is a kind of difficult question what will be the logic hidden in this question so let's find out what is the logic over here so if we take column 1 and uh, if we multiply with column 4 and then you have to subtract with column 2 by adding column 3 so you will be getting the answer let's check it out 4 into 2 minus column 2 is 5 and 3 so 4 2 is 8 minus 8 that gives 0 which is nothing but column 5 so here we have tried with row 1 so let's apply the same logic in row 2 so 
so if we apply this same logic in row 2 sorry no need to go for row 2 we will go for row 4 directly and uh, 9 into 5 minus 6 plus 5 so we all are aware of 9 5 is of 45 minus 11 so which is nothing but 34 yes 34 is there in option a so the correct answer for this question is 34 and uh, you can also get this kind of difficult questions too in the topic missing numbers you can easily solve this kind of questions if you have multiple practice more practice in this topic so with this two sums, i would like to conclude this video thank you students have a great day bye bye